Hello and welcome to Yes Let's. Today we have a very special first video because it's Shakespeare's birthday! Woo! Well, actually, the specific date of his birth was not actually recorded. Well, his birth date wasn't actually recorded, but he did get baptised on the 26th of April, and his birthday is widely celebrated on the 23rd of April, which is today! <laughs> so, happy birthday, Shakespeare! You've probably heard that name before. Shakespeare. But who actually was he? Was he an actor? Was he a pirate? Was he a celebrity? Was he a fashion designer? Well, he lived a long time ago. A long, long, long time ago before iPhones and laptops and computers and social media. So historians have had a bit of a tricky time to piece every little detail together. The author Charles Dickens once said, The life of Shakespeare is a fine mystery. Ooh, mysterious. But what we do know for sure is that William Shakespeare was born in Stratford-upon-Avon in England in 1564, and he was a playwright. Some people call Shakespeare the bard. Bard is a Scottish Gaelic word which means poet and in medieval times, bards used to travel around the country, collecting and writing epic stories, and then they would retell them to others in theatrical and musical ways. It seems right then that Shakespeare was called the bard because he wrote really epic stories. He wrote about all sorts of things. He wrote about kings and queens, ancient times, great storms and battles, and he even wrote about mystical things like magic and spirits and fairies. Do you know any Shakespeare plays? He wrote three types of plays, comedies, tragedies, and histories. It's thought that William Shakespeare wrote at least 37 plays. Wow. His plays were performed to everybody, from the poorest to the richest of society. The poorest audience members used to stand in a place called the yard, which was a space in front of the stage with no seats. So they would stand in the audience, right up close to the actors. They were called the groundlings. In the Globe Theatre in London, they still have the yard, and they still call the audience members groundlings. I've been a groundling before, and you're so close to everything. It's magical. We'll be talking a lot more about William Shakespeare on Yes Let's, but for now, let's wish the Bard a very happy birthday. Well, that's all for today on Yes Let's. If you'd like to see our future videos, you can subscribe to our channel. We've got loads of really fun stuff coming up. We've got crafting videos, acting activities, sing-alongs, and lots more information about people like Shakespeare. We hope you have a really brilliant day, and we'll see you next time.